Women should not exercise judgment in political affairs. If we allow women to vote, it will mean the loss of social structure. Vote for women! Vote for women! Vote for women! Vote for women! Vote <laughs> you work at the laundry? Part time from when I was seven, full time from when I was 12. We meet Mondays and Thursdays if you're interested. You a suffragette, Mrs. Elliot? I consider myself more of a soldier. As Mrs. Panker says, it's deeds, not words, that will get us the vote. We've identified weaknesses in their ranks. We're hoping one of them will break. They're saying she's to speak. This is a deliberate escalation. This has to stop. For 50 years, we have labored peacefully to secure the vote for women. We've been ridiculed, battered, and ignored. Punish those responsible, whatever way you can. <laughs> Mama! All my life, I've done what men told me. Well, I can't have that anymore. Took my love, took it down. I incite the women in Britain to rebellion. Can I sail through the changing ocean tides? Can I handle the seasons of my life? We break windows. We burn things. Because war's the only language men listen to. Well, I've been afraid of changing. There's nothing left but to stop you. Built my we're in every home. We're half the human race. You can't stop us all. But time makes you bolder, even you might lose your life before this is over. I'm getting older, too. We will win. I take my love, take it down. Never surrender. Never give up the fight. In the snow covered here.